Good evening, guys, and welcome back to Cricket Captain 2023. We are back in a big game. Big game in the county championship. We win this game, we will leapfrog Yorkshire. It's also like we've got a game in hand, but obviously Yorkshire are playing in it, so we'll still have a game in hand. Um, but we will leapfrog if we can get this win here. Sussex are looking pretty good. Can we take a look at the fixtures real quick um, and see... Sussex are playing Kent, so there are there are games all around um, the league today. So we'll have to keep an eye on them. We've got Redfern promoted from the youth team. Where is he, and what does he do? Um, he's a wicketkeeper batsman. Okay. Um, let's tell him to play some second team stuff for a little bit. Um, Bavuma, we've got to change the team a touch. Nick Brown goes back in. He's nice and fit. Looking good. Um, Rossington is not going to bat there. Rommel's going to have to come out. Or do I want to give Daniel Bo drum? He's not very fit. It was a risk last time. Let's let's open with Tom Prest. He's not. He doesn't really want to open. If we take a look at his personal, he'd rather bat at four. But we're telling him to open. We kind of need him to. Uh, we do kind of need him to. I want Bell Drummond to play second team and kind of get a little bit fitter. Uh, Travis Head's looking a little bit better. Bavuma really hasn't. We haven't played him a lot. Um, it's because of the whole having three overseas players. Like it's it's a little bit weird because I'm trying to rotate them. But to be fair, Travis Head hasn't played a lot either. Um, but Simon Harmer we can't really drop. His wickets are too important to the team. Um, Gates, Cali, Oldman's looking like he's in good form. He's in good nick. Benkenstein, Redfern, who's just been called up from the youth. I don't know if we want to play him straight away. Is this the team we're going to go with? Is this the team we're going to go with? I think it might be. Dan Lawrence. I think Dan Lawrence actually did have a good time of it the last no he didn't he didn't okay hmm okay we're gonna bring back bell drummond but he's not fit not fit okay we're gonna we're gonna give ryan Moore another chance he's only had two chances snater is yet to play a first uh uh what's actually what are the conditions the pitch is gonna degrade i think we need gates we need gates it's going to degrade we need another spinner willing to willing to bowl some spin we've got wesley we've got hey we've got tom prest as well but oh i don't know actually you know what yeah i'm gonna give snater a go I'm gonna let him have a go um because he hasn't played he hasn't had the chance to play a game this year so i'd like to give him a go let's go let's go let's oh, we really got a bat first we are okay, brilliant. We're gonna bat first. Oh, we won the toss. Lucky, lucky, but we won the toss. An important toss to win, I think that one was. And Rymel, okay, Rymel, I'm gonna tell <clears throat> to um to really calm down and play like a slow innings. He batted well, I believe. He did. He batted well in the second innings against Surrey, which was an important fifty. And he's got he got a fifty against Surrey. Maybe he just likes facing Surrey. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, I'm just gonna tell him to bat slow. I don't care how long it takes. <clears throat> facing maidens out is actually fine. I don't mind it. I don't mind if he's facing maidens. Um, because Nick Brown at the other end, I have a little bit more faith in. Like he's a top player. Ryan will come on. Yeah, okay. Well, actually, that might have been a net. No, it was, it was a classic shot. It was a classy shot. Okay. Let's take another step up in aggression here. See if we can just, you know, I don't want to tick along at one or two and over indefinitely, you know. <clears throat> ah. Okay. That's not great. Okay, I'm not going to tinker with anything for a little bit. I just want to get Tom Prest settled. Oh, the spin's already come on. It's going to get a wicket. going to get a wicket straight away. 
now we're more or less in the same situation where I need Wesley to get settled, but they've got an aggressive field on him. Oh, and he's put it for four. Oh, it's the same over Wesley again. We've made 50, which is great. That's going to be another four. Brilliant stuff. Okay. Rymel, you can go to the next level up on aggression, but I, I don't want anything more than that. Shot from Wesley, yeah. Because we need Wesley to get settled. We need Rymel to just kind of keep doing his thing at the other end. The big innings is what we need here from our... From our our Moffitt, he's absolutely slapped at one. He did not need to be slapping at, but we've still got still got Travis Head in. Still got lots of batting here. Okay. Yeah, good stuff. Let's just try and get to the end of the session here. 80 for three. It could be worse. How are Sussex doing? They're bowling against Kent, who are 93 for one. Okay, that's not bad. Okay. okay, let's keep going here. Clicking through the overs. I do not want any wickets this session. I'm saying it outright. No wickets conceded. I'm not even going to tinker until we reach 100, which we're about to by the looks of things. Yeah, there we go. We're 100 up. And things are going well. There's no real need to change anything just yet. If there was a crazy amount of maidens, that one went for four buys, by the way. Um, I would start changing things up, but there's no need to just yet. Still looking good. One, two, one for three. A good recovery. But we're going to need a little bit more. Ah, Travis Head. You were settled, buddy. You were settled. You didn't need to go after that one. Okay. Wesley, come on, buddy. Yeah, shot. Cheating. Four runs. Don't mind a maiden here and there, like every now and then. We're at 137 for four. The run rate's pretty, pretty average here. I don't mind the odd, the odd maiden, like I say. Shot from Wesley. Yeah, he's looking good. He's, he's close to a 50. Okay, Rossington. That is... That is... That's infuriating. You should not... You should not be doing that. Two wickets lost in this session so far. Water smacked that one for four. Good, good work. And is Wesley going to get his 50? We've got 150 as a team. That is 50 up for Tom Wesley. That's a great performance. A great performance he's put in so far. Let's... No, I'm not going to change a thing. I'm not going to change a thing. Still too too early to really tell him to go for it. The, the team position is a bit too a bit too strenuous to, to tell him to just go for it here. Especially when he's batting well. He's got 64 well-earned runs. Oh, off the edge for Walter. Goes for four. Get to the end of the session. Come on, guys. You can do it. Just do nothing. Just turned a mile. Nothing silly. But leave a straight one right before the end of the session there. On the autoplay, just letting them bat. Shot, Wesley. Yeah, great shot. 191. The bonus points are still important, obviously, but the match is way more important. We need to need to make sure we can put up a... Oh, come on, Wokesy. Put up a competitive first innings total. 200 is not really enough, to be honest. 206. If Wesley does get out, I'll be heartbroken. That's not out. Because that'll that will really kind of symbolize the end of the innings, really. Um Sam Cook's looking okay. He's looking okay, but don't do anything silly. Oh wow. Well. No oh, why have you slapped absolutely slapped at that? For no reason. Shot from Snater. 
Oh, there's a long way to go in this game. We've got to get to the get to the end of the innings at some way once. Oh, Snater. Okay. Westy's going to keep the strike if we can. No ball goes for four. Nice. Tell him, Wesley, just keep the strike. Come on. Oh, it's going to be a close one. Wow. Safe. And Wesley does keep the strike. Come on, guys. You need one run to get a bonus point here. Oh, my word. Wesley gets his 100, gets out. And we're one run short of the... <laughs> oh, that's infuriating. But it's a good performance from Wesley um, when clearly clearly it was not easy. Let's Yeah, first over, let's just give it to Simon Harmer and see what he can do. Um, here we go. Armour to Wharton. Is it going to be runs? Is it going to be wicket? It's going to be... No, it's not out. It's it's close, though. And there we go. Maiden to start. Trumpet offside. So we're going to... Uh, you know what? Let's just start with a regular line with Chris Wokes. Two from it. Okay. Don't really want to do that. There we go. Let's yeah, just a regular line. Ah, four runs. Okay, fine. Good over from Harmer. He's going well. Wokes he's not going too bad, but I'm gonna try and keep changing things up here. Um if if we're not taking wickets. Here's a chance. Wokes to Wharton. No, couldn't find the edge. Another chance. Wokes to Luxton, not out. Armour to Luxton this time. Come on, early wickets could still win this game for us. There we go, that's the wicket. That's what we were looking for. That's what we were looking for, indeed. Okay. Okay, it might be time to change Wokesy up. He's still going well so far. They're at 48 for one. But they have batted, obviously, quite slowly here. Wokesy's very tired, so let's go to Sam Cook. Oh, here we go. Is it a wicket change? Armour to Wharton. Another wicket, and we'll really start putting the pressure on here. It is indeed. Great catch. Great catch from Sam Cook. Joe Root comes in. You know what? We're not going to change it. We can get Rooty early. Bruh. Brain stopped play, and Root was absolutely tearing, tearing Simon Harmer apart. We've lost another 36 minutes. Hook to Milan. It's gone. He's gone. 89 for three. Brings in Johnny Bairstow. They're both aggressive bats, but Joe Root, obviously an incredible batsman. Test match average is 47. One day average of 57. What the heck? He's he's He's, he's an incredible bat, but we're uh, giving him a bit of what he wants here. That's better. That's better. Cook to Root. Can we get him early? Oh, it's going to be in the air. It's going to be in the air. It's high in the air. There's a fielder under it. We've taken it. Tom Press takes the catch. And Joe Root's gone. We've got to keep Simon Harmer on just because it's a turning pitch. Um. Sam Cook's bowled really well. Let's give the ball to Paul Walter. Paul Walter, two bears though. Can we get rid? We can indeed. Caught and bowled. Okay, 130 for five. Um, if we take a look at the comparison here between the two, Yorkshire are batting faster. They're more or less at the exact same. Look at that. The wickets are really falling at the exact same points. 
But they had us for four and then five. If we get another two wickets in quick time, because we, we recovered in the last, last part of the innings. But if we can keep the pressure on, um, let's change it up. Snater's going to have a bowl. Snater to Bosley. Oh. Water to Hill. Nothing there. Okay. There's T. And they're 158 for 5. We lead by 91. Which, to be fair, we don't have a lot of runs on the board. They could easily still come out of the blocks and get some, get some big runs here. So let's. Let's bring on our economical bowlers. Yeah, that's more like it. And maybe grab a wicket as well. Oh, edge around the corner for four. You lucky duck. Cook to heel. Come on, we need the wicket here. That's not out. Wokes to heel. Come on. It's taken. What a catch. What a catch. Oh, my word. Oh, my. Well, I did not expect that. Wokesy needs to change, so we're going to bring back Simon Harmer. And here we go. Maybe another wicket. 197 for six. There we go. It's another wicket. 197 for seven. The lead is only 52. Let's not forget. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Oh, nothing there. Okay, Sam Cook's bowled so well, but it's time to change. Let's give the ball to Tom Prest just for a little bit. Harmer to Bosley. Come on, buddy. Come on, Harmer. There we go. Bowled him. 202 for eight. Simon Harmer's on for a five for if he can get one more wicket. He's looking really good here. Oh, it could be the last ball of the over. Could be his five for. That's got to be gone. It's gone. And there's the Pfeiffer for Simon Harmer. That's perfect stuff. Okay, press bowl to good over there. But I'm going to give the ball to Snater to try and finish this off with some pace. Oh, okay, not quite. Harmer again. Can he get six? Could he get six? He can indeed. Six for Simon Harmer. And we've got first innings lead. We've actually got a first innings lead. 21 overs left in the day. It'll actually be a few less. How are the other games going? Sussex. How did... Wow. They collapsed. They collapsed. They were 93 for one. And they get bowled out. Nine wickets for 100 runs. Glamorgan have already beaten Warwickshire. What the heck? It's only been two days. That's insanity. That's absolute insanity. I do not get it. Hampshire are in a really good position, but Durham are fighting back. Somerset, that's an even game, but sorry, look at that, struggling a little bit. Kent, we're going to need a big innings here, as are we. As are we. The pitch is turning. Josh Rimel did well in the first innings. 24, actually. No, he didn't do that well, really. But let's see what we can do here. I don't mind. I do not mind maidens here. We want to build our lead and we want to build it slowly if we can. Edged. That's going to be four runs. The highlights are on runs though. So that's, that's what we want. Okay. Leech to Rymel. Come on, buddy. Oh, edged for four. We'll take it. The lead is up to 76. Like, it's a good... Having a first innings lead is, is really something else. It really gives you a bonus. Like, we're only 39 for naught. Make that 43. But we've got a lead of 89 runs. Just, it puts things into perspective a little bit. And we've got to the end of the day, without losing a wicket, I'm really impressed. Now, can we keep it going? Great work from Brown. We've got, we've got a chance here. We've got a chance here a big chance here to get this win against yorkshire and uh oh rymel's picked out the fielder silly batting that's genuine that's some silly batting and that's even worse from tom prest he has not had a good game has he 
A three and a duck. He does not like batting a number three, it would seem. Good shot from Brown. Another good shot from Brown. A poor start to the day. But you could also put that down to the fact that the, the conditions are not good for batting. Like that first innings lead was incredibly important. Yeah, great shot from Brown. He's on for a he's on for a big score here. Come on, buddy. I can feel it. Come on, buddy. Wesley at the other end. That's gonna be four. You can't bowl there. You can't bowl there, buddy. And the same again, you've just given him another full toss. It's a bit silly to bowl there to him. The lead's at 139. Edge but safe, because that, that looked like it might have been able to carry there, actually. Four runs to Wesley. And that's 50 up for Nick Brown. Incredible stuff. Incredible stuff. I'm really, I'm really impressed with the guy. He's still batting so well for us at the top of the order. not out okay it's still quite difficult to bat here but they are settled so we're gonna just tell them to go one step up and yeah great shot and that's all we're gonna do i'm just gonna auto play it for the rest of the session hoping that they don't they don't get lose any wickets sorry they don't do anything silly and pick out a fielder a bit like ryan will did like he was on for he was on 20 like he was he was doing okay. He didn't really need to um, try and smack one out of the ground. It's a bit silly. There's lunch. That's a good recovery. If we take a look at the, take a look at the the wickets falling. They obviously fell really. Was it in two overs? It was. That was two overs from 50 for naught to 51 for two. We've recovered well with um, with Wesley and Brown at the crease, and they're they're still looking pretty settled. So we're just going to tell them to keep doing what they're doing. It don't matter. It doesn't matter if they bat like a little bit slowly. The score is a little bit more important. In fact, it's a lot more important. It's way more important. We've got time in this game. We'll have time to bat. Uh, oh, that's gone. Okay, Nick Brown is gone. We'll have time to to bowl Yorkshire out on this hopefully horrible pitch by the fourth innings. Shot from Travis Head. Missfield. It'll go for four. Yeah, great shot. The first uh, task from now, from where we are now, midway through the third day, is I'm going to say we're going to try and bat the rest of the day and, um, and see how much of a lead we can build. It would be very nice if it could be a, a big, big lead. Yeah, Wesley. Great stuff. Great stuff. What a shot. That's an incredible shot. Yorkshire have taken the new ball. That's fine. Um, let's tell Travis Head he can go a little bit more aggressive if you want to. Wesley's gone. He got 80. Shot from Rossington. That's gone as well. Okay. Porter is going to come in. There's T. And like I say, I still want... Um, actually, let's tell Travis Head to calm it down just a touch while Walter hopefully gets himself settled. Yeah, shot. Oh, that's Edge. There's a fielder down there. Walter's gone. Travis Head is gone. Okay. And I, I really, I don't want us to get skittled out at the end. Oh, my word, Sam Cook. Come on, buddy. Two, four, four for eight. Like, we were in the driver's seat and then just some silly, some silly batting. I, we got to take some time out of this game. Otherwise, Yorkshire will just look at this total and think, yeah, we can grab that. Uh, 
Okay, that's fine. Sharp, Wokesy. Okay, we got the lead up to 300. I mean, that's good. That's what I like. 307 now. And we have indeed taken some time out of the game with this 10th wicket stand. Till Harma picks out the fielder. Yeah, like the strike rates are terrible, but we did, like I said, we took out a bit of time of the game. Uh, the pitch is turning, the bounce is uneven. Let's go straight to Simon Harmer. You know the deal. You know the deal. We took six wickets in the first. Kuhneman took five. Like, the, the spin is clearly the way to go here. Yeah, great stuff. Um, let's give the ball to Sam Cook. Maidens to start Yorkshire know that the conceding wickets will be the death of them. Here we go, a chance. Second ball of the fourth day to really set us up. That's an edge. That's been given. Oh my word. I didn't know if that was an edge or not. It was it boy, it looked like it, but Okay. Yorkshire three for one. Another early wicket. And we are in the driver's seat. Cook to Milan. Cook to Milan. Edge taken. Nick Brown brings in Joe Root. Oh, my word. We know how dangerous Joe Root can be. Joe Root could absolutely take this game away from us if we let him. Cook to Luxton. Oh, edge for four. They're both aggressive here. They're both aggressive. It can't work forever, though. Edge taken. Harmer takes a simple catch. Oh, here we go. Okay, changing it up. Chris Wokes comes on. Oh, instant wicket. Instant wicket for Wokesy. Bairstow's gone. Yorkshire 44 for four. You do not want to bat fourth in the county championship. You do not want to bat fourth. That is basically the rule. Armour to Hill. Can we get him 50 for five? Come on, buddy. Come on, that's straight. Oh, not quite. There's a long way to go now. Rooty's gone. Wokesy's grabbed Rooty. Palmer is. Taking another catch. You can't get you can't keep him out of the game. You can't keep him out of the game. Woke the hill. Oh, close. No cigar. Okay. Give the ball to Tom Prest. Oh, if you get to wicket with this first ball, I will I will actually lose my mind. It's straight it's bowled him. <laughs> Tom Prest. He's he's not even a bowler. He's not even a bowler, and he takes wickets. When he bowls, he takes wickets. He has he, <laughs> he bowled one over in that first innings. He only went for three runs. I brought him back. He's taken a wicket with his first ball. It's a wicked maiden. It's a wicked maiden. Oh my word. Okay, give the ball to uh, Shane Snater. Um, yeah. Oh, it could be another bowling change wicket instantly. Oh, not quite. Oh, but it still could. Oh, safe. Goes for six. Seventy-five for six. Yorkshire need 230, and if I'm being honest, I can't see him getting it. I cannot see him getting it. Tom Prest is bowled so well. Like, almost too well for kind of what he's, what he's doing. Uh, let's give the ball to Walter now. There's lunch. They still need 216. They've only got four wickets to play with. Um, Tom, The thing is, Tom Prest, if he's not going for runs, I'm actually going to keep him bowling. Um, because we're trying to build pressure here. Water to child. Come on, there we go. We need a wicket. Oh, wedge down. Goes for four. And Simon Harm is going to come back on. Because he is our most likely to take a wicket on this horrible pitch. And there we go. He literally does straight away. Straight away. I could get another one. Harmer, the reason we got the first innings lead. And the reason we're going to win this game, if he keeps going like this, he's on for a FIFA as well. There's only two wickets to get. Um, pressed at the other end, hopefully keeping the pressure on. So far, so good from Tom Prest as well. Like, he's not a bowler. And we're telling him to bowl. Can we get rid of Kudaman? Can we? Oh, he's edged it down and safe. Um, 
Let's give Tom Press the rest. Bring on some pace at the other end. Just to alternate. Keep things going both ways here. Yeah, that's good stuff. Two more wickets to wrap up this game. That's one of them. Nick Brown takes the catch. That's the second catch he's taken this game. This innings, should I say. Now it's just going to be finish things, finishing things up if we can. Almata Leach, can we wrap it up? Can we wrap it up? We can. Oh, we cannot. It's not being given. Cook to Leach this time. Oh, no edge. Let's auto play until that wicket comes. Cook to Leach, come on. There we go. He's gone. A big win. New user record. Another 10 for. Simon Harmer, what a performance. 4 3 2 1 0 0. Tom Press gets one wicket, but look at that economy. Sam Cook's economy. Look at the economies. And then we gave the ball over to the pace bowlers to give them a go as well. And those economies aren't terrible either. Doesn't matter. 1 5 1 all out. 1 5 1 all out. And we didn't even bat like incredibly well. We didn't get an explosive innings anywhere. Sussex take a big win, a 10 wicket win. God dang. Dang. Somerset beat Surrey by 92 runs. That's a closer game. Closer game. Um, that's not a close game. And Durham got skittled a bit like Yorkshire. Yeah, basically, look at that 158, 159. Yeah, just we had too much in the tank and we go up to fifth. We've still got games in hand here. Let's not forget. Sussex are the problem. They keep winning. And they look at that batting points. They're batting so well. They really are. Take a, take a look at this year's first class averages. They're batting so well. 39, 50, 30. Just. It, Riley Rousseau. And he doesn't play first class, obviously, but. Really good stuff. Really good stuff. Let's take a look at my finances. 981. We're doing okay. Like, we're doing okay. I don't really know how important the finances are in this game on that kind of stuff. Um, We've got a coaching session. Let's try and get Bill Drummond do a bit extra practice, I suppose. Um, Tom Westy's. Oh, he's no, he's not injured. He's having some. He's having extra physio. Everyone's looking a little bit better now. It's like the rotation has improved things. Porter's back as well. That's great to know. Sussex have won the blast. Yeah, Sussex are absolutely tearing things up. It looks like we've just lost Travis Head. Yeah, we have. So Bavuma's going to have to come back into the side. One last look at the table, guys. We've still got that game in hand, which is the potential for 20 points or so. Um, which would shoot us all the way to 124 points, third in the table. But Sussex, they're really looking good. They really are looking good. And we've done a lot better this year at kind of turning those drawn games into, into wins, which is kind of what we were struggling with last season. We need, to, we need to win more games. Sussex are doing exactly the same. They're just winning everything by the looks of it. Um, and they've won the Blast as well. They're, they're looking so good. It's actually, it's actually a bit like, like, come on now, calm, calm it down, please. Um, if we take a look at their seasons gone by, where are they? There they are. That's actually crazy. It's actually kind of crazy. A runner-up, a quarter-final. They won the county championship. They've already won the blast this year. Um, seven wickets. It looks like they did it kind of easily. Four runs against Warwickshire in the semi. That's a closer game. And um, still got, oh, we got them in the one-day cup, but we're not playing them again in the county championship, which I'm not sure how I feel about that. What are our county championship games left? Actually, what have we got left? We've got... We've got Durham, Warwickshire twice, um, Glamorgan, Kent, Hampshire. So, Durham, Warwickshire twice, Glamorgan, Kent, Hampshire. We don't have to play, don't have to play Sussex, and we don't have to play Somerset. And that win over Yorkshire was quite, 
quite convincing in the end. Either way, guys, thank you so, so much for watching today's episode. A big win. Simon Harmer, take a bow. Really, just take a bow. What a win. What a performance from the lad. Um, six for 79. Four for 56. Just what a performance. And what a performance from, you know, from the batsman as well. Like Tom Wesley, big, big score. 82 and 100. A 50 for Nick Brown. On a pitch that was clearly, clearly hard to bat on. Um, yeah. Simon Harmon not out in the first innings. Yeah. Great stuff, guys. Seriously, thank you. Thank you for, for watching today's episode. We're at 182 subs. We're trying to build the subs up as we go. Um, but I'm in no rush. <laughs> I'm in no rush. Seriously, we're, we're, I'm just enjoying enjoying the YouTube channel. And I hope, hope you guys are as well. Thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you next time.